Hello friends, welcome to Lug Life. And you may say, Adam, why in the world are you covered in a black trash bag? <laughs> it's actually a very good question, but it's not just me covered in a black trash bag. Let me show you. You can see our studio, my chair, the floor, an entire path covered into the bathroom because Sherry, what are we about to do? Glitter beard. We are gonna do glitter beard. So a little bit of context, um, a lot of you guys know I am in this beard growing competition with the American Cancer Society called Grow Nation. And you have to take a photo, submit it, and that is what the judges vote on. Now, I am not in the beard length competition per se. I entered the freestyle category where I can be judged on whatever I do with my beard. So some of you guys will remember a few years ago, I did glitter beard. At that time, Sherry said, hey, cool, but also, by the way, we're never doing that again. Beca because we, be Sherry also just knocked over the ring light. Because we are still to this day finding glitter in our house from that. Well, I want to do glitter beard. And I want to do the Alaska flag in my beard. So we are going to glitter my entire beard blue. We're going to put gold stars like the Alaska flag in my beard. I'm wearing a yellow shirt. I've got my Alaska flag hat, and we're gonna take a photo and submit for judging. And I thought, you know what? If we are gonna do glitter beard, we gotta vlog it, because you guys gotta see this. So, um, just about to start the, pro the process. Uh, what a weird way to start a vlog. Thank you guys for supporting us through lots and lots of weird things, like when we cover my face in glitter. All right, so we are all set here. Sherry, first of all, thank you for allowing me to do glitter beard for the second time. I know you are not excited about this, <laughs> but it's for it's for a really good cause. I know. And I that's know. what matters. I know. We're gonna help some people. So let me show you guys what, <laughs> it's so stupid, it is so <laughs> stupid. Also, Missy's out here and she is so confused why the floor is covered in plastic. She's kind of excited though. But she, she loves like it. Laying on she's it. like, she's walking back and forth She's like, it. the whole floor <laughs> crinkles? What is this magic? <laughs> <laughs> she died. She thinks she died and went to heaven. Yeah. This is cat heaven. Okay, so here's what I got. I got some fine glitter that is like a Alaska flag blue. No, fine glitter, because it's so small, it won't get everywhere. Like fine glitter stays more... <laughs> oh, it doesn't. And then we have these stars because the Alaska flag is eight stars of gold on a field of blue. Alaska's flag may it mean to you. Do you want me to sing you the flag song? No? Okay. So the plan is to either use these yellow ones or these gold ones, depending on what shows up best in the photo. Yeah. Okay? So the whole goal of this is we're going to do this and then we're going to take like one still photo of my face that gets submitted for judging. Mm -hmm. Now you might be saying, Adam, what do you do? Just like put the glitter on your beard? Not quite. First, we're gonna cover my entire beard with a glue stick. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. This happening first. Is so stupid, it's so stupid. So it's actually pretty simple, honestly. We are just going to do exactly what you I'm think. Move your phone out of the way. Oh, moving my phone out of the way is probably a very, yeah. very good idea. I will have you know, I bought a brand new glue stick for this. Mm -hmm. I'm not using an existing one of Sherry's that I give <laughs> back to you with beard hair. Hey, Sherry, here's your glue stick back. Mm -hmm. I mm. really appreciate that. Mm -hmm. Well, I do love you. I know. Hey, Sherry. Yes. When you were a little girl <laughs> and you thought, you know what? I wonder what married life will be. I did not think watching my husband paint his beard with... This is not what you imagined it to be? Glue. Huh. And then cover it in glitter. Really? This is not what I imagined. This isn't what you imagined? It's not. And that's well, shocking. I know. I'm a little surprised at that. Okay. Uh, so, here we go, you guys. I'm now going to... Oh my gosh. It is so... <laughs> Look at how awesome it is. Oh my gosh. It's a lot of spillage, so you can probably put a little bit less in your hand. Anything for a good cause. You, you know that. Do you do the glue? Do you want me to help? You know what? I would love for you to help, actually. Okay. I just did that part. Let me see. Yeah, oh, I yeah. Missed all of this, oh, no. I missed all of that. There you go. 
All right, so I think we have the glitter beard. About as glittery as we can get it. So Sherry's gonna go through and just clean up like my lines, my cheeks, my lips. Actually, for your lips on your hands are disgusting. Yeah, you're not gonna. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Nope, you're gonna, gonna do that. I look like I murdered a Smurf. So the idea that actually came to be in an Instagram Live, so this is like our Leg Life community has contributed to this. The idea is an Alaska flag. Now the Alaska flag is the Big Dipper, right? Blue background and then Big Dipper. Let's see if this is gonna stick. Again, Sherry, there's a lot of things they don't tell you in pre-marriage class. I know, I really kinda wish I'd known. So here we are guys, we are cutting off my my cape, my plastic. And then once this is cut off, I'm gonna to try to move as little as possible so that I am not covered Hold still. I'm gonna come around to side. in blue glitter. You guys, we just took photos. I think we have a winner. You like this one? That one, you wanna show them? What do you think? That is me. <laughs> Perfect. Before we kind of turn the camera off and I go clean up from all of this, mm -hmm. uh, you guys have to see like the area. <laughs> this is why Sherry covered everything. Covered everything. Look at this. Like oh, I am covered. Even with the the bag over him. Like look, oh. at, look at your shorts. No, I know. Like even covered with a bag. It is <laughs> glitter. We are going to be finding blue glitter for the rest of our lives. I blame you. I was like, Do I don't. You? I was like, I don't really want to do glitter beard, and you were like, it'll do so good. And I was like, no, Sherry. Mm -hmm. And yet here we are. Here we are. And just like that, I am showered and cleaned up all of the glitter. Well, okay, most of the glitter is out of my hair. I don't think it's all ever truly gone, but it actually came out pretty quickly. So there you go. I cleaned up all the trash bags. Sherry's amazing. Look at this, you guys. Like all of this is clean. All of that is clean. It's already been vacuumed. The trash bags are already up. Sherry Beth, you are amazing. Thank you for your help. How did that go compared to our last glitter beard? Um, it it was harder to get it to stick to the beard. Yep, I more like, meant the cleanup process. Um, I feel like the cleanup was better because I planned ahead. With all the trash bags and With stuff. With all the trash bags, like the whole route to the bathroom. I agree. Thank you for letting me do that. I think we're gonna go get on Instagram Live now. Uh, we got on Instagram Live when my beard was crazy and glittery, <laughs> yeah. and now we're gonna get on and show them the. Uh, the cleaned up transformation. Yeah. And I'm gonna submit my photo. And Sherry, fingers crossed in 48 hours, we'll know. Maybe by the end of this vlog, you guys will know if I won. Yeah. I hope. Hello friends, it is a couple days post glitter beard. Mm -hmm. um, I have a story I have to tell you guys about the glitter beard night that you don't know. <laughs> um, so, so glitter beard night was crazy, right? We can all agree, Sherry? Yeah, it was a lot. That night I realized, huh, I don't know where my wedding ring is. We both thought that in the Chaos of Glitter Beard, I probably just like set it down somewhere. Set it down somewhere, like on a shelf or something. It's like, oh, it'll turn up. Mm -hmm. The next night... With both of us looking everywhere. It hadn't turned up. And so then I go back and I start watching the footage to see like, when did I have it? When did I not have it? The Glitter Beard clips that you just saw, I start applying the glitter with my wedding ring on. Then eventually at some point my wedding ring comes off and that's when I realized, oh, I bet what happened is that I took my wedding ring off because of all the glue and glitter. It was my fault. No, it was not. Hold on. No, it was not. And I set it like a buffoon on the table. With all the glitter. With all the glitter and glue and stuff. And while I was in the shower trying to fix this, mm -hmm. Sherry, being the loving, amazing, supportive <laughs> wife she is, gathered up all of those trash bags and put them in a garbage bag. Like I rolled them so careful so that glitter wouldn't like fly everywhere. But one of the problems was what else was in there? His wedding ring. My wedding ring. So we threw my wedding ring away. So I was single for 24 hours. <laughs> no, was, is that not, not how it works? That's not how it I'm works. I'm not sure how it works. <laughs> uh, but we did. Nope. I you did because you went into the trash and found my wedding ring. Now it was kind. It was easy because. Um, because I was really just not wanting to get glitter everywhere, I didn't just put the bag full of glitter in like our normal trash can. You I were put very, it in yeah. its own bag. And so all of those trash bags we had lying throughout the house, I rolled up carefully and I put in one big black trash bag and then I took it out to our like dumpster. And then Sherry went out and found my wedding ring in the trash bag. Right, so I just had to pull that one bag out and I didn't even open it. Like I literally laid it out and I just like felt for the ring because 
the only thing in there was trash bags and the empty glitter container and the well and a wedding ring and wedding ring <laughs> and the glue stick but like all of the hard there were only two three hard things in there everything else was just bag and so i just kind of like felt and then i was like oh that's the container there's the glue oh there's the ring and so i just like pushed it up the side of the bag and like out the top so glitter beer was a, <laughs> was a success Correct. retrieving my wedding ring was a success yeah. and we're hoping that tonight is also a success i hope so because it is about six o'clock we are heading to the like the grow nation wrap-up party tonight where they announce the winners yeah fingers crossed yeah. fingers crossed i did see that one of our personal friends is actually on the the like panel of the voters. judging panel so we'll see we'll that, know tonight that could be good or bad like she could just vote because we're friends she could also just vote because we're like not vote because we're friends or she could and vote she because my glitter like. beard was freaking i mean amazing. I, that's what i'm hoping so but we'll see. we're gonna go and <laughs> see if by chance i won yeah. you guys will know here in just a little bit whether i'm getting a trophy for the glorious glitter beard that almost cost me my wedding ring and marriage no oh just the wedding ring just the ring okay Okay, so this is crazy. We just pulled into like the place where they're having the award ceremony, which is like right up here. But we found a place here called Roundabout Books, established 2021. I've never heard of this place that we need no, to act. A, a new bookstore in Anchorage that we don't know about? <gasps> Sherry. Oh this is a big day. Yes. And over here is where we're going for the uh, awards. You guys, we um, just got our food. This is like a Marsala grilled cheese. Um, if and these are garlic are fries. They're amazing. And we just started our, uh, our award ceremony. The business beer category is the category that is for those folks that just started growing or like to keep it high and tight. I do have to congratulate Adam Legg for winning the freestyle category. Come on up, buddy. <laughs> You did blue glitter paint and the Big Dipper stars on his beard. Super dope. I'm gonna try to pull it up so everyone can see it. This is Adam Lake's photo. Oh, don't lose the stage. Uh, blue, huh? Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty awesome. Now I had I had to go from like my Jack Frost Santa Claus three. You know that was mine. That was the ten. But Adam had to go with the Alaska thing. Always wins. Oh, I was with the last of always. So congratulations, Adam Leg from Leg Life, our freestyle category winner. Keeping your ear, or are you trying to shake it? Well? And we're going to raise some money. Yeah. Yeah. Really but that, that's what I like to hear. First place freestyle. Uh, yes. Pretty cool. Oh, he's and then a whole bunch of beard stuff from uh, Permafrost. I love it. Oh, it's oh, it's right. 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 I like this guy. <laughs> does, does the wife like, does the wife like the... So. Yeah. yeah. See, should he keep it? Should he keep it? Can we keep it in well, December? You know, I, I am really proud of our officers, and every year this is such a big event for us. And everyone who comes and donates and really enjoys it, and it's such a big morale booster for us. So, out of that, I've made the decision to allow our officers to keep the beers. The end of the year. Yes! Right. You guys, I won. Yeah, you did. Grow Nation AK, first <laughs> annual beard contest, first place in the freestyle category. Whoop, whoop, <laughs> whoop. Sherry, <laughs> yeah. is it worth having half of our house still to this day covered in glitter? Uh, I don't know, but I mean, a little bit. like. It's so cool. One. And here's the here's the coolest thing is that yes, I won. Uh, this is the first time this event's ever happened here. Right. We raised forty five thousand dollars. Forty five thousand dollars for people to grow their beards. For the American Cancer Society, all it's the amazing. money is going to help right here. It's such a huge deal. Yeah. Um, it it was just so so cool. At the end, so actually this cool thing happened. You guys saw some like the beard shaving. So if you grew a beard, if you participated. Uh, you had the option tonight to basically auction off your beard to have your beard <laughs> shaved to the highest bidder. Right. However, <laughs> there was like a turn that none of us expected 
Right. Because what happens? Well, one of the guys, the guy who actually won the wizard beard, who he has, like, it's seriously down to, like, when he's sitting, it's sitting on his lap. His name's like, Jeremy. You guys might have seen him in some of the clips. Uh, long At the beard. World Beard Competition, he took fifth place. Fifth in the world. Fifth in the world. It's an impressive beard. And it's he, amazing started so there was a bid for like whatever however meant and, and he said i will bid x amount for him to keep the beard to keep the beard and, and so that, like turned the whole auction so at the very end <laughs> the last person that went up is uh police chief mccoy he's the chief of the anchorage police department yeah. uh just like the coolest guy now here in anchorage our police department is not allowed to grow a beard right. with the exception of during the month of november right so police chief mccoy got up there and there's there's talk and like some momentum to like change that so that our right. police can have beards which and i'm a fan of the the police department raised twenty five thousand of the 45 they were the top team the police department raised twenty-five thousand right. dollars, which is awesome yeah so police chief chief mccoy gets up there and he has a beard he participated but he announces um that he's going to let officers keep beards through the end of the year so he's going to add an extra month yeah <laughs> and so then they're up there and the police chief's going to have his beard shaved and i'm just like wait a second hang on that can't happen and so sherry and i ended up being the high bidder to let our police chief keep his beard <laughs> through the month of December. Yep. I just yep. feel like I feel and like he was so excited about it and his wife was excited too. She's like, his I wife like was beard. excited. She's like, I like the beard. <laughs> and so it was just so cool because he came up, shook hands at the end. Um, but I just feel like it's Alaska. We need a bearded police chief. Right. I right. agree. I mean, beards are sexy anyway, but like oh. also I just feel like our police chief, like the chief of police he oh, needs to a have beard. a beard. Also, it's Alaska. So we made sure that our police chief in Anchorage <laughs> has a beard at least through the end of the at year. At least through the end of the year. <laughs> Sherry Beth, you've never been to an event like this before at all. No, I have not. What'd you think? This was fun. It yeah? Was, it was more fun than I was expecting. We were kind of expecting to like show up, say hey, and like take off. Like not really like hang out the whole time. But it was fun. It, we, were, we were here it for... It was fun like chatting with people and... Well, yeah. so part of it, part of what made this event so successful is that, uh, so we had this leadership team, this team of ambassadors were called, they <laughs> kind of helped pull this event off and make the whole thing possible. Mm -hmm. And we've been meeting for several months and it really just helps that like that whole ambassador team is just like such a good freaking team. Right, and this is actually the first time, like I've met Casey before, but I haven't actually met um, like a lot of the other people on the team. And so it was fun to like, actually put a face to the names that he's been talking about of like these amazing people that have been heading this up so and it was cool because tomorrow morning so in my category that i won <laughs> it was me if you guys remember and casey bieber who is our radio dj on 101.3 yeah. kgot uh who i defeated yeah you did i crushed no i didn't really crush his beard was spectacular <laughs> um he invited he had me on, a good entry but you were suspect. he had a great entry <laughs> ma uh, he invited me on the radio tomorrow morning yeah he said since like the gauntlet the challenge was thrown down publicly i need to come on the radio right. so he can publicly acknowledge me as the winner yep. but i'm gonna get to go on the radio again tomorrow yeah. morning I'm debating whether I should bring my trophy and just like hold it the whole time while Casey's in there. Just, just like, like hold it. it. <laughs> I wish I could like have this like screen printed onto a t-shirt and just like wear this on a t-shirt. <laughs> Obviously a very different vlog than you expect. A beard focused video, which if it was up to me, Leg right. Life would just be a beard appreciation right. channel. I did find out that in like the beard world, like the world's competition, women can actually use their hair there's a category and <laughs> so we had a category in this and competition i feel like i could pull it off it's called the whiskerina whiskerina and the ladies you could crochet a beard you could make a beard paint out of flowers beard. you could paint yeah. a beard on so we're doing this event next or year or use your own hair and so i'm trying to convince sherry she needs to enter the <laughs> whiskerina category next year uh, how about sherry and adam both winning first place next year uh, you guys, I want to, <laughs> as, as we end this vlog, I want to thank you guys because the reason we raised 3000 over $3,000 mm -hmm. is because of you. In fact, that was one of the things at the event they commented tonight when they were talking about leg life. Um, they talked about how amazing it was that so many donors came in from so many other states. Right. Um, you guys did that. And so I just want to say thank you so much, uh, not just for all the ways you support us, but the fact that you support causes that we believe in. Um, as we said when we announced that I was doing this, cancer is one of those things that I feel like has impacted all of us. We all have a cancer story about us or somebody that we love. Mm -hmm. and, and so for us, we wanted to lend 
I don't know, we wanted to lend our leg life platform, our influence, whatever, whatever influence we have to this cause so we can raise money to make the cancer journey easier for families. Yep. And uh, this event, $45,000 will help families on a really, really, really hard journey. Here and in Alaska. that happened because of you guys. Right. So thank you all so much. I won my first beard competition ever. <laughs> so exciting. I love you guys so much. <laughs> and we will forever remember Grow Nation AK because we will be finding blue glitter in our house forever. But we found my wedding ring. We did. You found my wedding ring. Find your Friends, ring. we love you so very much. Thank you for a beard-themed Vlogmas video, which I never expected to say in my life. Yeah. We love you guys, and we'll see you on the next video.